While I'm doing marketing, it is very interesting to study brands and understand their strategies on different things that they are working on. Today, I'm going to talk about one such popular brand, which has become a home name and which has also marked itself effectively. That is Maggie. Maggie has uh, effectively played the emotional marketing very well and it has established its own consumer base. Today, we are going to talk about different strategies that they have implemented. So first one is understanding consumer sentiment, family bonding and nostalgia. Maggie positioned itself as a product that brings families together, evoking memories of shared meals and happy moments. The advertising often focused on the emotional bond between mothers and children, highlighting how Maggie is a go-to snack that kids love and mothers can trust. Second is convenience and comfort. The brand emphasized the convenience of preparing Maggie, appealing to busy mothers and working professionals. Maggie also marked itself as a comfort food that is easy to make, providing a quick solution for those hanger pangs. Marketing strategies, which were very key. The first one is emotional storytelling in advertising. Maggie's ads featured relatable, heartwarming stories that resonated with a broader audience. Campaigns like Mary Maggie invited consumers to share their personal stories and experiences with the brand, creating a community feeling and user-generated content. Second is product innovation and customization. Maggie introduced various flavors and regional variants to cater to local tastes, making the brand feel more personal and inclusive. The brand continuously adapted its products based on consumer feedbacks. Now this showed that it listens to its audience and cares about its customers' preferences. Third is leveraging digital and social media. Maggie used social media platforms to engage with its audiences, share recipes and create a buzz around new product launches. They ran interactive campaigns, contents and different challenges to keep the audience engaged and involved with the brand. Fourth is price management with a positive spin. With this point, I want to highlight it was in 2015 that Maggie was banned in India due to safety concerns. The brand faced a lot, a lot of significant crisis. Maggie launched a comeback campaign once again when the ban was lifted, focusing on regaining consumer trust. They used emotional appeals, highlighting the product's improved safety and quality and played on the nostalgia factor to win back those consumers. Fifth is community building. Maggie created a community of loyal customers through initiatives like Maggie Diaries, where they showcased the versatility of Maggie noodle in different recipes. They involved influencers and chefs to share their unique takes on Maggie, reinforcing the brand's presence in everyday life. What do you think? What is the conclusion out of the entire content that I told you about? Let me draw one and if you have something different, please do write in the comment section. Maggie's emotionally charged marketing strategies helped it maintain a strong market presence and loyalty even during challenging times. By focusing on emotional connections, storytelling and community engagement, Maggie successfully created a brand that people not only trust but also feel a deep personal connection with.